And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Bruce the Dragon! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Amir the Prince Abaze! Ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angles, just absurd. And a heart got to simulate in training. You think you got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Both fighters throwing heat now. Rips the body there. And follows up with another one. Oh, man, hate to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Oh, punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing the shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. All right, right into side control. Upper body strength figures to be put to good use here. Yes, absolutely. And you got to look for his opponents to turn back into him. He should chase guillotine, but the opponent turns to the opposite side to take his back, throw his hooks in, try to choke, or flatten him out and just go for the finish. Nice. Nicely done. Oh, now gets an underhook to get a more dominant position. He's in a good flow right now. He's landing big shots to the body. Oh, nice knees by him. Man, he does not discriminate. He is throwing to all parts of the target tonight. They talk about using all your weapons tonight. He is using those knees to slow down his opponent. Leg kick lands, my favorite strike. Wow, vicious uppercut. Does a great job of mixing up the strikes. Lands another leg kick. up, he opens it. And he's back up again, so the takedowns have been there, as have the get-ups. Amir Abazi's cut above the eye now from that strike, so we'll see how the fighter deals with that definite adversity now. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Oh, big left hook there. Work by Amir Al Bazi. Nice takedown. There you go. Well, you know he's comfortable fighting off his back. Lee get peppered here from the top. He's got to figure out a way to cover up. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge and reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. All right, so he's dealing with some swelling upstairs, and you got to think his opponent is going to continue to attack that region. Well, he has to. He's starting to see now the work is being done. He's starting to see the benefits of the work with the swelling that's starting to occur. Well, the octagon, not a great place to be when you're looking for a rest or a stool. His stamina has been a huge issue tonight. It's abandoned him, but he did it. He tried. He fought as hard as he could for as long as he could. Now it's about survival mode. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal. Oh, he's got him hurt here. That leg kick hurt. That jab working nicely done. Oh! All right, 
it seems as though his sole focus is attacking that cut. And man, it's getting bad now. A lot of blood flowing. Yeah, as it should be. Right? He should be focused on getting to that cut. Make oh, oh Alpazi shine for a submission here. Oh, that Kimura looks tight. Listen, defense holds up, he gets out. He said that he was ready for everything that would be thrown at him. In that position, he showed that and proved it. He's bleeding from the mouth now. He cut there on his lip. That doesn't look like fun. Another big hit. Oh, a very close round. A takedown like that might be the difference. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cut man will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs a strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that, but when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. You ready to fight? You ready? Go All right, round two. Nice straight right hand. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at 39 seconds of round number two. Declared the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks 